Hi, I would like to show a new feature in Babette. I'm working on it now, so not everything passes yet. Um, but there's a new feature I added. Uh, it allows you to continue your run. Uh, this is an experimental feature, and that's why I demonstrate it in this video. So first we're going to do, um, so this is the test. It's the, the function will be called Babette Continue, brilliant name. So to do a run with Babette, so this is how you normally run it. It needs a FASTA file, um, which contains the DNA or the protein. Uh, it needs an inference model, so how it's going to um, build up the phylogeny, which assumptions are in there. And it needs uh, the options that are used to call BEAST2. So usually you don't need this one. Usually there's a default uh, created one that uses temporary files to store temporary files at. In this case, it's also important to have it constant. So here I'm going to create all these three. So as a FASTA file name, I'm going to use a, a one that's default. This is a very short one. Um, so I want to use that one so the tests run fast. Um, but uh, let's take a let's just take a look at it. Let FASTA file name. FASTA file name. So I'm just going to read the text. So here you see there are one, two, three, five species with short DNA sequences. Um, an inference model. We could just create a test inference model, um, which is basically very short. It uses all the defaults from uh, Beast 2. And the Beast 2 options, we're just going to create a standard Beast 2 options uh, setting as is default by Beast 2. And that's all we need. So now we can uh, run by bat on all of this. And let's do that. And that takes very short because I took a very trivial example here. So Babette out contains all the results from this run. Um, for example, it contains the posterior trees, which are four. It doesn't show them here, of course. You can plot them using density. Um, these are the estimates. Uh, so apparently it's a Yule model. Uh, this is the estimated birth rate. So this is the. these are the samples. It, uh, so this is the MCMC results. So now I'm going to do the new feature. I'm going to continue. And uh, actually, it's just the same as this. Uh, these two are the same. You just do a bad continue. And uh, then it simply continues to run. And um, this is a bit of an experimental feature. So I have no idea what can go wrong here if you use different FASTA files or inference models or Beast 2. I have no idea. I do know is that uh, I now have more trees, which is seven. I now have more estimates now it goes to six thousand instead of three and i do know if i continue again that also this works nicely so now i have 10 trees which you can prove here and now i sample until the 9000 mcmc state so in this video i've showed you how to use babette to continue the run uh, i hope it was very helpful if you find a bug please let me know I'm always happy to fix those. And have a good day. Bye.